Hello Lone Star Drift audience, I have the dumbest video for you today. I wanted to post this video and I couldn't figure out how to do it because it's weird to post somebody else's video. This is not me driving, but I was talking to my buddy Dion and he was like, just post it, make it funny. Um, I don't remember exactly what he said, but Vincent, my buddy on like an airbag, super slammed, crazy S14 with a 1JZ and like 20 inch wheels, sent me the video. I saw it, I laughed at it. I sent it to Dion. Long story short, I'm posting this. I'm gonna do a voiceover. So let's get started. This is a box truck out of Bosnia and Herzegovina or something like that. I don't know where this thing is from. Drifting in the snow, and this thing is ridiculous. It looks like the guy is braking the entire time and trying to slow the truck down to keep it controllable and like push the weight down on the front end. And like this guy is absolutely killing it. I don't even know how he's doing this. I'm assuming that whenever the thing weight shifts and like the body comes around, he's on the brakes, and whenever we see like snow pop up from the back, we can tell when he's on throttle. I don't even know. Um, God, this guy is so cool. Look at that. Like he goes over the hill, it's almost in the trees there. This guy's insane. You can see the rear tires, like it's a dually. How is it even spinning the tires and everything? Obviously it's an ice, so I get it, but it's still ridiculous. The way he's transitioning the weight and everything is hilarious too. But think about how little steering he probably has. Here you can just see it wandering all over the place as he manjis it. I hope this is a rental truck. Oh, I just saw there's two takes there. So that wasn't one whole take. That's okay, it's still rad. Oh, he just knocked snow off of trees that were going by. That is really close to a telephone pole. Oh, wait, no, we just saw the brake lights finally. He's not on the brakes the entire time. Here he gets stuck trying to go uphill. This is amazing. You can see how little traction there is. Wow. I'm mesmerized by this, I don't know if you can tell. The cool thing about ice and snow is it slows the vehicle down so much. I have some experience uh, snow and ice drifting trucks, so I, I know how it feels. And the super long wheelbase of this thing makes it transition super slow and controllable. I mean, considering it's on ice and I've never actually drifted a box truck. Um, so it's probably pretty controllable in some ways, but since I doubt it has a manual transmission, this guy's just straight getting it. God, this is so cool. Also, from the look of the box and everything on back, it doesn't look like he ever hits anything. This is amazing. Oh my God, and the followed cam just like Rex. That's amazing. That guy's not even drifting. I love all the snow coming off the trees as he hits him as he goes by. I can't even comprehend what's going on. I just know it's cool and I want to do it. Up, oh, we have another cut. There's houses around. You can see them up on that little hill. Up, oh, hits a tree again. That is so cool. I wonder if he's just full gas and lets the thing like the rear wheels hit the berm on the side, so the snowbank, and he can't spin out because of that. I wonder if that's the secret here. So it's like playing bumper cars. This is amazing. Oh no, we're about to be done. We're about to be done. Amazing Drifter, thank you for entertaining us. This was amazing. Oh, you can see his license plate, this was amazing. Thank you very much, that was amazing.